So, because our bags are two capacity, well, the big one is because of the weight limit. The other ones are two capacity. We have been using a little trash bag to put anything else that can't fit. These are all the things that couldn't fit the suitcase. What's in here? Slippers and what else? It's slippers, a rain cover for a car seat. And then also jeans. This has turned into our suitcase too. Our excuse is what? They don't let her have a carry-on, so this is her carry-on <laughs> right here. <laughs> oh you goodness. That's to make it work. The system trying to break you, you gotta try to break the system at times. <laughs> yep, so that's what we're gonna do. It'll be alright in here. This little bag came in handy, I tell you. Not even just for this. Just for a whole lot of other stuff. So all I do is grab this little string, pull it nice and tight, and I'll tie it on when we get there so it doesn't open. And you can tie it on now because what do we need to take it? Because we're driving to that. Come on, baby. Make it tight. There you go. All right, we out of here. Any last words, sir? Young lady? Uh, no, ma'am. All I know is we need to get up out here before we miss this flight. Miss this flight or miss a chance to go in the lounge? <laughs> No, the flight. I'm not worried about that. I'm just early. Because we're early. How are we going to miss a flight? Well, you never know. You never know. Are you sure right? It was fun. You mountain. The mountain. You. I, I hope it's not bright. No, it's still nasty out there. Just cloudy. They didn't want us to see the top of the mountain. It is what it is. We'll come for you next time. Montserrat. Is that what it was? Montserrat? Yes, I don't know, but let's run. But we out of here. We're gonna call this Uber. We're gonna call this Uber ah! and make it to the airport. It was fun. We're glad we recovered. So so. So so. Ah! Alright. Let's go. Let's go. Say bye. Ah. Say bye. <laughs> You excited?
come the stars come to shine when it's dark oh my goodness that was a lot one it was a long drive it was like 43 minutes actually no let's start with let's start with wingo wingo is a low cost um airline but we like wingo wingo's pretty good it's taking care of us every single time our baggage was over and they didn't charge us and we had a carry-on and they were like well you can just check it in and it's free and we we're like okay because we didn't try to check it in because they thought they want to charge us so that was convenient i'm telling you wingo just we will be taking care of us what oh and they allowed us to switch out our other big carry-on for Mombi's backpack or a backpack and we're like, there was no charge, no nothing. And we're like, Wingo, this is how you get loyal customers. Because it's not bad at all. So you take care of us, we keep using your airline. Because they're good to us. And it's a good deal. Two, past Wingo. We arrived. It didn't take us long. It was quick, quick, quick. That was good. All of a sudden, it was time to go. The Airbnb, I would say the check-in was a little hard this time around because one the address she gave me an address but there was also an address on airbnb i didn't check the details because i just thought she was rewriting what was on airbnb because every time i just it's easy to just copy it through airbnb and then keep moving anyways it was the wrong address we drove far then it looked like a super sketchy area right I'm like, I know we ain't staying over here. It looked super sketchy. And then to get there, it was like a hardcore roller coaster. Like these people live, live in the mountain. And they live. Okay, let me, I, I think I don't, I can't emphasize it enough. They live in a mountain. So you are climbing, your car is going up like a roller coaster up the mountain. It's scary. Especially when they have to stop and then you hear the car go backwards. Like my stomach was uh, dropping. Was, my stomach was dropping. I was nervous. I felt like I was really on a ride. But these people are so comfortable. They over here speeding, going. I'm like, I'm going to sit in the back and I pay no mind. Because I usually suck being a passenger. Uh, passenger. I usually suck. But... I can't say nothing here because I don't know didn't they squat. I'm like, shoot, you gonna take us there. He took us there real safely. We got here pretty fast. Uh, then arriving at the wrong place. Then we called the lady. We came to the right spot. We had to pay him extra. Sad part is we didn't have extra money, but we just ended up just giving him the extra money through tip because we didn't have any extra pesos and we didn't have change for dollars. So that's what we ended up doing. <sighs> It was hectic. I feel a lot better where we at though. Mm -hmm. But we on the side of the mountain. It's crazy. See, at first we was living at the bottom of the mountain, but now we're living in the mountains. So it's a little different over here where we at now. So our last place, it was you know pretty level where it was at. You know, over here, everything is like built in the mountain. So, you know, we're in the mountain. Uh, we're about to go find us something to eat. We don't really know where. The lady did tell us we can go get something to eat at the little market down there. But, yeah, it's a small little market. So, we may have to catch a cab to the bigger market so we can make sure we get food for this little one. So Yeah, but we'll go see how that little market looks to see if we have everything we need yeah, today. Yeah, we, we'll go check it out. We'll go check it out. And hopefully, they do have some food in there she likes. Yeah. There you go. And one thing is... As much as we were worried about elevation, I don't think. We're not that high. Huh? We're not that high to be worried. Even regardless, oh, the airport. The I think the airport is in the top, like near the top of the mountain, right? Because whenever we I don't got know up, about that, but, you know, okay. because whenever we were left the airport, we were going down the mountain, and then I don't know where we were. Started going back up the mountain. Even not the very top, it was pretty high. It's really cool how they have all of this on the mountain like this. Mountain living is something else.
There is a pool. There is a park. We can't even get out the garage. We don't know how to get down. I don't understand. I guess the lady didn't think it was important for us to know. Maybe she thought we'll figure it out. We are high and we're trying to find a way to get down there. And we don't know how. There's some stairs. See what I'm saying? How we gonna go? Oh, is it stairs right here? Oh no, this is not stairs. There has to be a way to get down. Okay, we found a way down. And this is how we have to go down the mountain. Ain't that something? Oh, but I guess you enjoy a nice view in the process. This is something. Thank God for her stroller. You can just carry it like a bag, make things easier. <laughs> Let me see her. You enjoying this? Mm -hmm. We almost at the bottom. You say your your head what? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, I look up for like two seconds when I stop a little bit. But we almost there. It wasn't so bad. This how it look. It looked like you're just going. You were going through the jungle, and they got sugar canes everywhere. You've got to watch your step. Oh, there's a little trash can. They said, please don't litter, but some still do. Just watch your step. You don't fall, because that would be tragic to fall. Mom be look like she having a blast. You having a blast, aren't you? Huh? Hey. <laughs> you made it to the ground. We're all the way up top. Say it again. I mean, not one of them. We made it down, oh. and we already made it to the grocery store. And it's a little restaurant. And the restaurant's here. That wasn't bad. Uh -huh. Okay, we ended up going to. I guess you could say it's from home. And we did the dumbest thing ever. We left my phone at the apartment because we just didn't want to carry too many phones. And all of a sudden, we realized the phone that we left was the one that had the address. To the Airbnb, and nobody remembered the name of it. It's, I only remember the first part with this unit ad and the name of the street, but that's not the full name, and that wasn't a full street that I remember. So, all I remember was Unidad and Kaya 96C. That's it. We, we struggled and figure out it was stressful trying to figure out how to get back without no address, and it's very spotty to get data. Like, at least if we're like, if we didn't have Wi-Fi, we're like, okay, at least we'll have data, but we don't have time to find data as well. It became a little... But well, we're going to eat some food, and then get more some food, and then we'll be good. But don't ever forget where you stay at. Write it down. Funny enough, I watched a video of a lady saying, write down where you stay at. And I don't know why I didn't. We at the mall. There goes Dre. We went to eat over there as Miss Carnes Paia. He got the soup, soup, and hen and rice. I got the bowl, bowl carne, and I forgot the name of his, but it looks good. Mombe co-signed the soup. Seems like he's taking a shot. <laughs> if Mombe likes it, and this is their, what you call it? I don't know, it's some kind of soup There's, that everybody talks about. Their signature dish over here. But, I mean, we gotta go to a mom and pop and give this a try. It's good here. But it's really good too. It I is. tried it. But I wanna go to a mom and pop and try it. But it's not, it's really good though. It is. I see why people like it. I know, me too. Even Mom B likes it. I know. Yum yum. I think we feel a little bit better. I think we found how to get back home. But Dre found it. 
and we found a way to get back home and we hope the address will be correct one because if not it's dark outside if we're not going to the right spot it's going to be tragic right sir yes ma'am because if we get lost <laughs> And did I, yeah, and I already said that it's hard to get data when you're not here. Yeah, I mean, we're like so, in the mountains, yes. it's hard, for us it's hard to get data on our You know what, maybe it's just my phone, because my phone is running only on T-Mobile Towers. We'll have to try it with my phone, but so I remember we'll when we were driving, it was hard for mine to Yours get the next too? But I don't know, we'll have to see next time. Yeah. But don't forget your phone, and know where you, know where you stay at. Yes, for sure. Without Google, shit, they're gonna, they gonna be locking us up in this mall. And, and you know what's even worse? It's the fact that, um, oh, even here, we didn't have Wi Fi. We had to, we were lucky we were able to find a free Wi Fi in here. Because if not, we had no signal either. That's true. It's the mall. In the grocery store. These stores are too beautiful. Oh, oh, oh. Mm. Don't even ask me what that is. For someone who used to work at the grocery store, this is nice. I'm not gonna lie, I love going to grocery stores. Cause your stuff is so different. Exhibit A. Look at the barbecue sauce, it's gonna work bad. And the tomato sauce, and the ketchup. It's salsa de tomate. Salsa de tomate. Got some barbecue. That's so on. It's cute. I mean, they still got bottles, but it's more bags. Water in a bag. So glad we made it back. I mean, we had went up and down that mountain, what, how many, about 12, two or three times? Two or three times, just like, I, this you, way? No, this way? No, no that's not right. He made so many U-turns. But it, yes, he did. But the thing is, I knew the building. I just didn't know how to get up to it. Because, you know, we in the mountains and it's like so many different ways, you know, that you can go up to mount, uh, up the mountain to get to where you need to get. Like, I'm sitting up there, I'm like, I see the building, but how do you get up? And the sad part about it is whenever the way that I told him to go, we went up there, but we, but turned around too soon. we ended up turning around too soon because we wasn't too sure. And, and then we couldn't remember the name to save our lives. And I found out that word Unidad that we were remembering, that word means apartment. That guy was like, all of these are apartments. We are like, <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> then another guy ended up saying the name, Montesi Paracio. I know yes. I said it wrong, but when I heard Paracio, I was like, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. Oh, oh that was stressful. Please, write down where you're going. Write it down. As a matter of fact, or just keep your phone on you. But you just know? in case internet I mean, ain't working for you. That is true. That is so true. That if is so internet true. ain't working for you, have, have it written down. Because yeah, so this was stressful. Cool. We had to track I mean, down how our Uber. You can, you can write it down on your phone in your notes. That's, yeah. that's what I did Like when we, when we was trying to get an address to come here. Like I just put it in the notes and I showed the guy. And he was like... He, you know, so. And the taxi wasn't bad, it's metered. So yeah. it's not bad. Yeah. Actually, the price wasn't that bad either. How much was 14? 13. Mm -hmm. Well, pretty much 14. How much was the Uber, Sean? How much was the price? I never got on Uber because you didn't, yeah. Do you remember how much the Uber was? I don't remember. Either way, taxi wasn't bad either. But yeah. man. I'm just glad we made it. That was stressful. Yes, it was. We'd be having a lot of stressful moments. <laughs> Especially for the first day, because we don't even know. How you not know? He was like, you don't know where you stayed in? I know. Dro was like, it's our first day. <laughs> but I'm glad. Let me show you the view at night. It's phenomenal. Oh, he's probably like that over there, too. It's like the galaxy. One thing I do like is those people playing. That's like... And you know the cold part about it? Like, the street was right here. You know what I'm saying? What? And like, the street is right here. And I seen the apartment over here, you know, from down there. And like, to get up over here, you literally have to go all... Oh, oh yeah, that down. was the confusion. Yeah. Okay, here. Because we came in this way and went around. Let me see if I can find it. 
where is that green thing okay right there is where okay no we have walked down these stairs all the way down and found out when you get down you're pretty much right over there then whenever we were in the car we didn't realize you had to go we well, first we went this way wrong then we went back and then we went this way all the way and then we got confused and then we went back hmm. and then we went back over here <laughs> but like, this and then we went back over here here and we found it. It's so confusing. Yeah. But I really can't get over the soccer I'm, field. Know, this little building right here with the soccer field, mm. it has a grocery store in there, like a small grocery store. It has a lot of restaurants in the bottom also. Too. I didn't realize there's another soccer yeah, field so in there. Is there one of you come through the elevator? That whole area was. The fourth two, floor? Yeah, it's just two areas. Oh, I didn't even see. Mm -hmm. That's so cool. Yeah.